So Ryan, first of all, we're here at the Performance School Festival. Um, a lot of young kids uh, at, working at a really high level. What impact do you think that's going to have in the future of Scottish football? Um, I think it's going to be great for the young players, um, young, all the young kids that attend here, because like, it's going to help them to develop uh, technically. And at, at the end of the day, that's uh, great for Scottish football if young players can be technically ready by the time they're 17, 18. And, and talk us a wee bit through your journey. I mean, what, what, you know, going from youth to where you are now, what, what, what's the journey been like? Uh, it's been, it's kind of happened uh, quite quickly. You know, I, I joined United at a very young age, but I feel like uh, I really enjoyed all my time there. And um, you know, it's something that, along with great coaching and hard work, it's uh, something that I always aimed for and what I wanted to achieve. One of the main themes of the performance school is deliberate practice and, and, and really challenging yourself uh, constantly. And, and I suppose you, in a way, have experienced that working at United and to, to take you on to a higher level. Yeah, I think um, realising that when you're doing sk- like practising all your skills and techniques, that repetition's really important. Just you keep doing it and doing it until it just becomes natural to you. You don't think about it at all. And, I think that's really important and something that these uh, development schools can help with the young players. And now into obviously Gordon Strachan's squad, I mean, how is that and the significance of that in terms of, of your ability? What are you picking up off him and, and what's the experience like in the national squad? Uh, well, I was just, I was really happy, obviously, to get called up and the experience of playing with the kind of players who play week in, week out in the Premiership. It's great for me, it's great to learn from those kind of players and I'm just looking forward to the rest of the week. In terms of guys like Andy Robertson, I mean, do you do you look up to him? Are you, are you, is there the things that you take off him advice? I mean, how significant is he to you? Uh, well, I think you know everybody kind of looks up to Andy. The his sort of story the last couple of years it's it could inspire a lot of people. So it's great to see that he's achieved what he has, and I'm sure he'll go on further as well.